Why should you use AI to make your Roblox games? There's a big debate among developers about AI. Should you use AI? Should you not? I swear, I see a new tweet about this every day. And this question is really a simple answer from me. For me, there's no debate. For countless people, there is a debate on this. If you ask me, the answer is obvious, yes. You should absolutely use AI to make your Roblox games. It's gonna make you faster. It's gonna make you save time. It's gonna help you fix bugs. It's gonna help you to do all sorts of things way faster. Sitting there not using AI because you hate it so much and you think that AI should be deleted from planet Earth is not gonna stop AI from growing from expanding you're not hurting sam altman you're not hurting open ai by not using their product i'll just tell you that so you you're better off just using it it's self-sabotage to not use ai hating it is like hating on a calculator or hating on a computer see the problem is most devs think if you use ai at all you use ai for everything oh he used ai in his game the whole thing is made by AI. Every model, every script, even the builds, all of it's made by AI. The idea was AI. The thumbnail was AI. The icon was AI. If you're using AI, any chance that your game was original flies out the window to these people because they think in binaries. Oh, your game's either a cash grab or a passion project. It's the same exact thinking. Your game is either made entirely by AI or it is made entirely by human spirit and soul. Look, man, you can make a game and it can be your idea and it can be your team and it can be your skill set and you can use AI at the same time. What a mind-blowing concept. What a mind-blowing idea. I can use AI to fix some bugs, to write certain scripts, give me a picture to reference to make my models in blender recently my dad did that on this game that we're working on he made this very cool pistol i'm not going to reveal what it is but it is a cheese pistol for some reason you'll just have to see when the game drops but ai helped him in that we had this idea for this unique pistol he went to ai he got an image that was a reference from chat gpt and then he used that to model the model in blender based on it and he was able to go 10 times faster and make a 10 times better result because he was able to get that unique reference image from ai did ai ruin his creativity no it accelerated it it made him more creative it made him more able to execute his ideas click the link in the top right hand corner right now and subscribe to get modeling tutorials from him and more. I would like to see him make a video about how he uses those AI references to make his models because the way that he does it is impressive. He's a skilled modeler and he's using those AI references to say, okay, show me an image of an SMG. And then he goes and he models that inside of Blender and he makes it very similar to the reference image, of course, with adjustments. So I'm gonna tell him to make a video about that. You better spam comments on his channel encouraging him as well. Now, most of the time when people are saying, don't use AI in your games, this is ruining development. What they're truly saying is that AI is a threat to my career as a developer. It's a threat to me and my skill set. The problem is when you're thinking like that, when you're thinking AI is a threat, it's gonna take away my job as a modeler or as a builder or as a scripter or as a developer overall. You're not thinking about what you can do to adapt. You're just thinking in this state of fear. Like, oh, everything is gonna be ruined because AI is coming onto the platform and AI is advancing. And soon enough, AI will probably be able to make entire games. What will we do? Instead of freaking out like most people, the better approach is to figure out how you can adapt and use AI to your advantage. Sitting here, flailing your arms and screaming on Twitter is not gonna help you to do that. It's not gonna help you in the AI revolution. So you're better off if you start using it, if you find ways to speed up your process, like my dad did, right? He has adapted to AI, instead of saying, oh no, modeling is gonna be replaced by AI. 
Modelers are dead. To be fair, he has said some of that. But instead of just saying that, he has found ways to use AI to his advantage. You are not a politician. You are not somebody who owns a big AI company. You are not David Bazuki. So you can do nothing about stopping the onset of AI from coming to game development, from coming to change how we make game, and from coming to change the world. So the only thing you can do is find ways to adapt, find ways to implement it into your process, find ways to speed up what you do with AI. For example, with content creation, I use AI to get ideas for videos. I use it to get images from time to time to place inside my edits. I use it to write tweets sometimes based on like based on a video script like this one. I could paste it in and say, hey, make 10 tweets based on this video, based on my takes, in my style. And you can get some good stuff. And now I've saved time. I've made some more content. I've repurposed it. And AI allowed me to do that a lot faster. So I am for AI. I don't, I'm not one of these people who's going to sit here demonizing AI because I know I can do nothing to stop it. I can't stop AGI from existing one day. I can't stop AI from advancing. I can't stop ChatGPT from being the number one app in the app store for productivity. All I can do is see this change and figure out how to use it to benefit me to benefit myself, to build better games, and to make my channel more successful, and to create more. And I am happy that AI exists as a tool. I don't have to spend my time writing emails to people. I don't have to waste my time thinking of an idea for something. And I recommend all devs do the same thing. Recently, I saw this dude on X, Finale Scripts, say, I'd like to hear a developer's opinion on using AI for game development. Do you support it? Where do you draw the line? Would you hire someone using it? And I said, look, AI increases efficiency. Time is your most valuable resource. Anything that will save it should be used. I am 100% in support of the use of AI in development. I would hire a dev who uses AI any day if it makes them faster while delivering a good product. So I won't just use AI myself. I will happily hire somebody who uses AI because they're smart, they're efficient, they know how leverage works. And that's what this channel is all about. It's all about strategy first thinking. And a huge part of strategy first is using your tools pragmatically, using things that allow you to ascend in your career as a developer. And one of those tools nowadays is AI. It's gonna allow you to make your simple games faster. It's gonna allow you to, I don't know, figure out Game Pass ideas faster. It's gonna get you some thumbnail and icon design concepts. And whether you use that for your icon or not, you can also use it to hire somebody commission a GFX artist and use the AI image as their reference. You can use AI to help you plan out buildings and locations in your games. There's so many use cases for it. And you have to look at AI as just, it's a tool, right? It doesn't replace you. It doesn't replace your creativity. Not 100%, but it definitely accelerates your productivity and creativity when you know how to implement it in your process. So that settles it. Click this video here to learn why cash grabs don't exist and exactly why you should make exactly what the Roblox community loves to demonize devs for making. See you there.